Well, I got all the feathers detailed and uh, ready to be put placed on his uh, head as a headdress. Um, that's going to come uh, not too far into the future, but a little bit. So I'm going to set these aside. Time to play with some clay. I also got the uh, rifle sketched in. I still got a lot of detailing to do, but I've been trying to figure out how I'm going to do this where he's holding the rifle and the flag at the same time and the reins of the horse. I guess I could do it that way. I'm just not sure, let's see. It gets too busy with all the, the flag and the gun. I'm thinking that he would have it resting in his arm as he's, uh, well, that may not work either. The problem is posi positioning the rifle so it makes sense. That's going to be the hard part. That may be the best position right there. But see, now I got a problem with the trigger guard. That's going to be, I got to be able to cast it. And when you start doing the trigger guard, that small. Uh, you're going to be running into real problems in making sure that it comes out in the mold. I'm going to uh, work on his arm today, and I'm going to put this aside and work on the rifle uh, upstairs maybe tonight. Just double checking my proportions. Make sure this arm is as long in the upper part as the other one is. Okay. That might be the best best position of the the rifle. Well, that's going to cost extra. To... The reason I talk about casting costs so much is because you don't want to have your bronze cost more than people want to spend, and a uh, hundred dollars extra increases your cost substantially on creating the uh, bronze
All right, I'm going to take some Ronsonol and smooth this out. This will be the last thing I do today. And then I'm going to call it quits till next time. I think that arm turned out pretty darn good. You got to be mindful of all the changes in the anatomy of, like, say, the chest when an arm is being brought up strongly to the forward and side like this. I'll work on the back of the uh, arm tomorrow. But, uh, You got to be mindful of all the muscles that come into play and even the fatty tissue that's uh, pushed up by the uh, the uh, bicep being pushed into the uh, pectoral muscle. Especially if you're doing a, somebody with no shirt on, you got to be mindful of all that action. I think I got it pretty good on this thing. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. I'll pick this up uh, next time. I'm, I'm happy with what's going on with this thing. Please give me a like and a subscribe. And ring the little bell. Also, don't forget I have instructional videos available now online. The link below this video shows you a link to a review of all nine videos. Later, everybody. Good night.